back to my YouTube channel. We are in Copenhagen. We um, just arrived, left London at like five o'clock. We're going on another adventure. The Uber is three Wait. minutes away. We should go there. First impressions of Copenhagen, wooden floorboards. It is so well put together. I feel like Big I'm fan. in a movie set. It's you look like you just need a coffee and a espresso. Yeah, that's how I feel. Welcome to the Denmark pad. It's so nice here. Lovely high ceilings. This time we were like, we're gonna do a drama free little holiday. Lo and behold, of course, this morning, I woke up with a sore throat. I'm sick. I woke up this morning, head cold, stuffy nose, sore throat. I can't even think. Splendid. So that was that. Um, and then also we had work. Ryan. Finally landed in Copenhagen. Who does he think he is? This guy. Hey. Why? Why do you do this to me? Heige, guys. Is it Heige? Heige? Hig. Hey, Hig. No. That's, uh, that's a way of life. <laughs> in the Nordic country. It is. Uh, hi, hi. It's, it's <coughs> H E J, right? Hey. Hey, maybe it's just hey. Hey. We've decided to venture out. Um, it's 9.30 p.m. here. Shout out to my Pilates instructor, Joelle. And you know exactly why. You know the one where you push the carriage out and you made me do those weird lunge things? And now my calves are on fire. And before when I had to run through the airport, dying. There's all these stairs in the apartment. So now good luck to me. We're gonna head to this little bar that we drove past. Looked vibey, looked cool. So many stairs. All the way to the top. Let's go. Good morning! Oh my gosh! We're in Copenhagen! Do you think I look Copenhagen chic? Are you asking me? Yeah! Oh, yeah. Hey, heaps. Those earrings. Looking lovely. My new earrings, handmade from the Brixton Market in London. Hot tip, really nice jewelry, handmade stuff. I also got this ring. So, we're walking. Where are we walking to, Ryan? <clears throat> Coffee Collective. Coffee Collective. It's apparently meant to be really, really good. Yum. Oh my god, I think these are cardamom buns. They are, yes, they do wear famous cardamom buns here. So we've been here all of uh, 10 minutes <laughs> and we're already having a great time. We've moved here, we've sussed out the apartment value. It's just really cool, there's such a nice vibe. People are so chic. I feel like I'm not even close to being chic. So one thing on the list to do this trip is shopping. So we're back home now. I'm just making myself a little pot of tea. We're gonna set up and do some work for a couple of hours and then find somewhere for lunch. Oh, this is 
dinner tonight? <gasps> Yum, I want that. That looks so good right now. <laughs> Time for dinner. Time for dinner. There's no Ubers here. So we're gonna have to either try and find some bikes, but it's quite late. Or maybe a taxi, or maybe walk and then get a taxi. I don't know, we'll see. We're getting the train. Finding a taxi was like <laughs> pretty much impossible. Oh, how romantic. A little walk by the canal, hand in hand. Half past nine in the morning. I've got a day off. I'm gonna do some adventuring today. And Shar is still getting ready. I'm so excited for today. Do you think I'll catch a cold? Well, I've already got one. <laughs> I hope it won't get worse. First and foremost is always the most important thing of the day. That's Number one, coffee. <laughs> breakfast was absolutely delicious but my hair was wet I don't know why I didn't dry it and I was just wearing one like little top under this leather jacket did not suffice so we were freezing so I'm going to be rugged up like this for the rest of today until I buy myself a new coat or something <laughs> <laughs> we are currently at a shopping center which we had to dash into because I needed to do a poo. That is too much information <laughs> for your channel. And meanwhile, Ryan had a really cool adventure and found this brilliant jacket that he's going to buy, not the green one, that one. And now I'm matching hats. You need to get that. Knuckles. Hey. I can't get it quick enough. I've been very busy and we've accidentally bought two massive bags of stuff. I don't know how we're gonna get it home, but we're having the best day ever. That sale was incredible. Who's the biggest shop <laughs> Alright guys. We're rounded out with a nice IPA from McKellar. Yeah. I can't even go there. <laughs> <laughs> we have emerged from our shopping haze and now we're gonna head home because we've got massive bags we're trying to move house so we've got to put an offer in on a house that our friend went to see for us this morning shout in out, Islington Nat. shout out to you Nat well done thank you for that so now we're just about to get on the tube and go home take the coffee seriously here So we're all decked out in our new attire that we bought today. Do a fashion walk. Ooh, who are you wearing? Bang, bang. I actually don't know. <laughs> Copenhagen I'm wearing. Are you wearing Copenhagen or is Copenhagen wearing you? Good question, follow me to find out. Now we're feeling all fresh and Danish chic. Now we're gonna head out, have a drink and some dinner. This was way better. Cheaper, 
the ambiance, it was happening, cool music. What a good evening. What was your favorite dish, right? Creme brulee. Oh, of course it was. Hey, oh, actually, beef tartare. Mine was the halibut on the train. It's cold today, 13 degrees. Layers on layers on layers on layers. Gonna dry my hair, put a little makeup on, and then we're gonna head out for a coffee. Day three in Copenhagen. Looking good. Do me a catwalk. Hold on. Damn. We're creatures of habit sometimes, so we just came back to that cafe that we were at yesterday, having a quick coffee stop before we pick up bikes. He's a happy man. I was just saying to Shana that I think Copenhagen coffee scene is better than Melbourne. Wow. I've said it on That's, camera. That is a big call. That is a big call. Exception. Cheers, big ears. Guess who's back? Back again. I think this adds to the uh, future homewares brand, right? Yes, 100%. One day when I start a homewares brand and I'm gathering it. Very cute. <laughs> Just agree, guys. Just agree. Yeah, I feel like <clears throat> Yeah, super. Are they chic. different from other ones that I have? Probably They're not. Like <laughs> so, yeah, we're gonna have a glass of wine and stumble into the afternoon. New earrings, new New woman. Hit up all of the shops, which has been amazing. We've uh, come to the conclusion that we've done enough shopping. We have. Have love today. Have a great day with you. Thanks, me too. It's been splendid. <laughs> it's been splendid. Cheers, darling. Cheers. We just rode here in the freezing cold and we're a little bit late, but this is the vegetarian version of Kim Kim, so I'm very excited. We start in the lounge with the snacks and then we move on to the um, tables for main course. <clears throat> oh, it's very moussey. Sun dried tomatoes. Oh my god, you're gonna love that. This is candy floss with beetroot powder and vinegar powder. Good? Mm. I can do it. <laughs> Too bad. I'm going in. Smoked watermelon, tate, avocado cream. Wow. 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 That looks amazing. Thank you. I can move it. Well, I don't know what it is, but all I heard was barbecue sauce. Oh wow. <laughs> You're gonna like that, right? I do really like that. <laughs> Tastes like chicken. <laughs> Come 
to Copenhagen, you should definitely go there. It was worth every penny. We had the best night awesome. ever. Every single meal was incredible. We're pretty sure that there was a food critic sitting behind us. Also, they gave Ryan a Side free note. cookbook. I was such a good guest, they gave me a free book. We're gonna cycle home now. It's getting chilly, so we need to get on the road. <laughs> it's I've got coffee everywhere. <laughs> Apparently, they have like a whole wall of Danish design chairs here. They do. Which I studied when I was at uni doing design. So I've been wanting to see this for years. Full circle. <laughs> already too cool for us. That was so cool! I had the best time. I saw all the chairs and I even got a poster of the chairs. just decided to come straight to a restaurant. Do you even call it a restaurant? I'm not really sure. It's called War Pigs. Apparently it's very well known. I couldn't care less. Obviously not a meat eater, but Ryan's very excited about this. Did you have a good trip, Mr. Badke? I did. It was epic. It felt like we were here for two weeks. We've time. done so much. It's been amazing. What a sunset to top it off. It's incredible, this place. You should kiss me, folks. Whoa! Pull my dog! <laughs> Gross! <laughs> By Denmark House. London, tell me what was the peak, what was the pit of your trip? The peak was probably rocking up to a 10 course fine dining menu. <laughs> that was pretty good. Shit -faced. And what was the pit? We're having to wake up at quarter to five this morning. My peak, I think, was cycling around because that was really fun and going to the design museum. I really enjoyed that. And my pit was probably when you had war pigs. Oh yeah, that was probably my pit. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, our next trip is Paris and then South of France, Bordeaux, um, North of France. I better do some Googling before we go there. Um, but it's been there. a great ride. See you guys there. Bye. See you next time.